What's up, YouTube? It's Craig and Peter. Both kept seven. I'm on the play. Sco. Layer of the Hydra. What? Health. I'm Before. supposed to do that. All right. I'll match you. Nice. Pass. Just one card. It's not a layer of the Hydra. No, it is not. I guess that's that's true. Yeah, mine's better. <laughs> um, let's. How do we want to do this? I think we just go pathway. Bolt your elf. Yep, exiled. And play a second elf. Nice. Go ahead. Draw a card. Mm hmm. And say go. Conclusion Forest. Fletch. Green. Green. Other, other. Questing Beast? Yep. That's got haste, uh, right? Yep. Go to combat. Hit me for four. Hit you for four. I'll take four. And then I will... Is that death touch two? Yes. Okay. And it can't be blocked by two, two or less. Uh, pay one green to cast Heart's Desire. Yep. That's a cat. <coughs> Oops. I swear I knew what colors these things <laughs> were. <laughs> and I will pass it. Alright, well... Play this tap mm -hmm. and leave crown visionary. Yep. And pass. Seems good. Draw. Play a land for turn. I'm, I'm just gonna look at my side. Yeah, yeah, no worries. We will pay four, five for a skyship flag sovereign. Um, when okay. he enters, we'll blow up your visionary. Yep. Then let's go to combat. Okay. Sixteen. Yes. Swing at you for six. Oh, I'll take it. Okay. And pass turn. And then I use two. Oof. Uh, let's... I think I just kind of lose the game here. So, yeah, we can go next. All right, right on. Yeah, no, I didn't really have anything that saved me that turn. And no, you... Yeah, I would have lost the next turn, essentially. There's no way I can do 20 damage in two turns with, like, nothing on board. Well, and I just cast the beast, crew the ship, and hit yeah. you for 10, so... Are you not running the stock list? It is not quite the stock list, no. Um, Craig doesn't do stock. I don't. Are you playing like Ooh, Ember Cleave version? No, no, this is Gruel Vehicles. Um, no, I meant like a, with, because there's a version of that with Ember Cleave in the sideboard that people like to run. Uh oh. So no. they don't like run Gigantha or something like no, that? No, I do not. You can have the main they took the Emperor out. You you, yeah, when you bring in Cleave, because the Gigantha version runs Cleave sideboard too. 
and so you just don't run the companion when you board in cleave. But you basically it. tell them that you put in the cleave. Or they line in the papers. <clears throat> right. Yeah. <laughs> I do not have a companion in game two. Oh, okay. No, I don't okay. run a companion because I main deck questing beast. I don't run a companion because I don't believe in companions. We know that. You're a loner. <laughs> I want to play wolf. pioneer, not standard. Or not commander. I also wolf. don't want to play standard. Standard is a mid range snip drop to this I have no idea what decks are even in standard. Do you like Pale the Mirror Breaker? <laughs> no. No. You won't like standard. Okay. Do you like every single every single deck plays Fable, huh? Do you winning announcement? Wedding announcement? Hate fable it. and Hate invoke it. despair. Like it. Yep. You can just play that. So I have to play black, red, and invoke despair. Yeah, that, they, there's a deck that's black. There's Grixis, Tempo, Midrange, Control. I don't even, I was just, I'm just saying words at this point. <laughs> <laughs> it fills all of those roles. It can. It's so weird. I mean, that probably sounds like a deck I play, though. Because, <laughs> like, Fable is used to play Fable, and it's ba Fable's basically Ragavan. I'm, I'm kidding. I, I, I swear. Fable is just an auto-include in any deck. doesn't matter what colors. Yeah. Well, then, like, I guess if it doesn't have red in it, you just splash red for fable. That's like actually what standard is. Right <laughs> well, you only need one red to cast it, yeah. and then it'll give you a second red <laughs> off the treasure. The tracks next play fable. The, there's five color tracks. Yep. The best part is oh, the only best happening? thing is that he doesn't fable. know. Yeah. Wait. Wait. What? <laughs> so I didn't even really so cut, cut your deck fifteen times. That's you know, Peter, what I think making your deck better. Four copies of Fable Mirror Breaker. Yeah, probably. Four copies. Yeah. yeah. Third, the third and you can copy Coco's shamans <laughs> every turn. It makes like, your Coco's worse, but who cares? Yeah, Fable. Fable's just so good, you know. Just take the matter. cords out. Put yeah. in the Fable. Like, do you take the Coco's out? Is Coco. It's oh a, my goodness. Uh, I'm keeping. Yeah, can you imagine just copying ah, shaman every too. turn? Too good. Why not? All right, fair enough. We'll start you at 20 life just because oh, yeah. I'm shaman. That'd be nice. Yeah. Fable <laughs> ends up just being basically mind rot with upside most times, but like that's just good. Oh. Yep. Stop and ground tap. Go ahead. You're allowed to shock that in. I am. I don't fear your elf. Yeah, don't fear it at all. Not one. <laughs> I right. do. I no. was like, sorcery speed, fatal push that thing. Yeah. <laughs> and pass. Oh, this is going to go real quick. Tapped. Go sure. ahead. Fair enough. Oh, that's gross. Oh, that's untapped. Uh, all right, well, I'm going to shock this in. And let's... Just spawn a sentinel. Mm -hmm. And. Does he have it? Shaman. Yep. So nice. that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Dang. Or 14. Um, and. A five man or I'll just swing with these three for uh, four. Right now, go to 10. And pass. Yep, game three. <laughs> <laughs> Quick games. He didn't have the sweltering suns or something? Anger nope. the gods? D didn't have that. Dang. Do they even yeah. play Anger the gods? You never know lands. what Craig plays. <laughs> well, like I said, is this is not the good list. This is my list. This is the fun list. Yeah. <laughs> sure. What, Sometimes like, magic's not about what playing. What was the comment the last week? Somebody said it was like, I feel like uh, oh. mono white humans is just a better deck than this. It's like, well, yes, absolutely, mono white humans is yeah. a better deck than four colored humans. With Jeff and Mantis and, Rider? Yeah, Matt responded and he goes, Sometimes you just want to play Mantis Rider. And I was like, Yeah, exactly. I was like, I want to play Mantis Rider, so I'm playing four colored humans. Yeah. Don't get why he went multicolor with Hymans. Didn't he didn't spell it right? Hymans, yeah. So much it's weaker Hymans. than mono. Yeah, you never want multicolor yeah. Hymans. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you just want to play Manus Rider. You don't care if it's good or not. Yeah, I like Manus Rider. Yeah, put a counter on it. Just, if you put a counter on it, you just 
can't lose. Uh, honestly, yeah, I spent most of the night just trying to get it cast. <laughs> Could you not cast it? Is the mana not good? Um, the mana's okay. You have... Obviously the problem is we don't fetch lands. You only have eight sources of red. Yeah, that's and it's the the human lands. Mm -hmm. um, but what about the Sacred Foundry? Uh, yeah, oh, it's not no, in you there. Can, you're right, because you need to have turn land. You're, so you're essentially running, running Bant humans with yeah. Manus Rider. The problem is, like, you have two different... You're manage, you're, you're, you got four one-drops that are all green, which makes it so awkward. Yeah. No, it's it's that, and that's why you have to lean so far green. Especially if, like me, you also run We need, uh, like, pack like noble high, like noble, Not even noble, noble higher. Right. Could get that in March the Machine. <laughs> Let's just print all the cards from Modern and right. here. <laughs> then maybe, maybe we can play Snapcaster Major. Yeah. They'll do that, and then they'll print better versions mm -hmm. in the straight to Modern set. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, Snapcaster Major. Because you have to keep them. You have to keep them separate somehow. Yep. Well, yeah. Well, you can't Snapcaster. If you're playing Snapcaster Major in Modern, you're like not winning. But no. <laughs> there was a time though. Yeah, and they were hating on my Aether Chandler. Like, well, not Aether, Aether Chandler, great. it's a it's great card. It's the fifth copy of uh, Reflector Mage. Yeah. Are you playing five? Or? No, and so I run. I, you do a split. I run four Reflector Mages in the main, and oh, then yeah. I have four Aether Chandlers in the board. Oh my god! Because if I ever need to. That's like insane on the. If you're on but the in the matchups where Reflector Mage is bad, Aether Chandler comes in because he draws cards and makes birds. That's fair. And so that's like right away you just go four for four. Because it's Honestly, like, oh, I don't you, want to bounce any. Uh, I don't want to bounce anything yours ever. Actually, Why would I, I bounce no, it out? It's fine with Reflector Mage because it makes them. It tempos them really hard. Like, but in the decks where it doesn't, <laughs> let me yeah, bounce your Shaman of the pack. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can't play for turn. I mean, like, yeah, but it's still another Peter, Shaman of the pack. And what am I even? Yeah. Know? Oh no, he bounced a land or else. He's got on four turn three. By turn three, it's like okay. Um, so no, do I, I bounce the mystic with the land or I think right. you could even bring in more copies of Aether Channeler when you're on the play, because then you get really good tempo. Well, on the play is, but I honestly, most of the time you make the bird because it's a one-one flyer. First land is game gets you an extra body, Second and Channeler is only a two-one to begin with. Third land is you turn to the Fable token. Oh, no, you just bounce the Fable token. Yeah. But the, that's the thing about Chandler. Like, Reflector Mage is way better because it bounces and then they can't recast it. Tell me the format's broken without telling me the format's broken. When you're building around, how, how can I deal with Fable? Yeah, Fable is awful. It's, like, it's a really good card, but it's just so hard to beat because you have to use Cuts. Both, both, like, both creatures and mana and answer. And then in between, you're also going to draw. Well, it's like basically always a three for one. No, it's like, yeah. You get you get a you get a pure two for one plus like another basically two for one and you get a draw, uh, and you get the treasure if you attack ooh, and you get the yeah, actual just, creature when it flips. Yeah, just because it's fun. God, this is a hard one. It does stuff eventually. Yeah, it's fine. But against you, yeah, I think I have to keep it. One lander, absolutely. All right, let's start it off with a. Tap Stompy Ground. Go ahead. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Copperline Gorge. Go ahead. I only own one copy currently. I think I. Uh, say go. Okay. On your end step, I will stop here. No. Oh. Dude. Move my turn. Lanowar off? Mm -hmm. Pass. Perfect timing on that elf. Yeah. Showing up late to the party. <laughs> Almost a land drop. <laughs> uh, pass. Yep. <sighs> I just have to do it. Um, let's obliterate both of and pass. He's stuck, folks. You're in my chair. That's why. Yeah. Should have, I should have swapped it out. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Untap. Draw. 
Here we go. Two, three. Sword of Forge and Frontier. Nice. I told you this was going to be like fun. <laughs> that. I think and stuff. It is. Yeah. It's pretty good. Especially. It's good against me. It's good against him. <laughs> it's not great against everybody else. But. It kind of sucks that the pro green sword just gets blown up by naturalized. <laughs> Two tokens. Uh, let's. Ooh, actually, let's think about this for a sec. Sorry, I'm just gonna no, think about something. Good, Is it okay if I look something up real quick? Or am I not allowed to do that? Do you Can need Oracle judge? text? Yeah, I want text for a card, but I also don't want him to know what the card is. Okay. You can step away. Yeah. You absolutely can. I'm going to open Scryfall, and then you can type the card name into it. I just want to double check here. Uh, Okay, cool. Just want to double check. Mm hmm, mm hmm. So let's go. It's like exactly what we were discussing. Another Dwinnin's Elite. Mm hmm. Uh, these have summoning sickness, so I'm going to keep them here. So let's swing with just these. Yep, five? Yep. Take it, 15. And say go. Did you shock er, him? Sorry. He did shock him. Oh, OK. I'm um, sorry. So no, I, you're good. Second main. Who owns Scryfall? And then. Hmm? Who owns Scryfall? I'll take one. Happens. Say go. Mm -hmm. Land for turn. How much to equip? Two. I think we just need to. Green and three for Seeker's Chariot. Yep. Make some kitties. From visionary. Mm-hmm. That's good enough. And let's do this before combat. Uh, I'm gonna both sage you that. So channel this both sage yep. you. I will go get a land. Yep. Ooh. Could be spicy, could hurt. Yeah. I have to not die. Basic? Yeah, basic. Okay. Oh, land with a basic type, correct. Yeah. Basic type, sorry. It's yeah, gonna be relevant. I think in that case we just bring in a tap stop. Then you're gonna swing for a lot, and then I'm dead to a shaman. <laughs> Cuts. Yeah. And I'm just gonna swing with these for nine. For nine. 
Yeesh. He tapped out. So I think the only we jump to a one each and take three. Yep. Go to twelve. Bye bye, kitties. You take how much? Uh, three. Three. Oh, sorry. I okay. Was, so I was staring at the goblins. You went thinking from fifteen to twelve. From right? fifteen to twelve. Yes. Got it. All right. Uh, pass. Okay. I don't think there's any way out at this point. But well, let's see. Man for turn. You know, the cool part of this card is that you can swing, and you, if you draw two lands, you can play them from there, I think. Yeah. Um, well, I played land for turn. Yeah, so even if, if you played land for turn, I think you can still play them. You can play one. You can play one. Because it allows oh, yeah. you to play an additional land. Okay, yeah. But that's not going to save us. No, it's just <laughs> cool. Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> I think your deck about Maybe. Probably wouldn't be bad on the sideboard. It's not a bad card. I mean, at the very least, it helps you dig. The protection is sometimes relevant. I really wish it had lifelink right about now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so to business. Let's. I think we pay two to stomp your visionary. You've already played land this turn? Yes. I'm going to cast Cord. Yep. Grab Shaman. Um, that's going to do it, right? So that's nine damage, because I think that trigger happens before that dies. Yep, it'll resolve before this does. So go you take two, nine. You take nine, go to three. And then I'm just dead. Sweltering suns, anger of the gods. Oh yeah, if they were here, they'd, they'd be really relevant. Dang. Um, let's. Yeah, there's literally nothing I can do. So we will have some fun, Craig. Well, I'll let you cut, anyways. So. Screw you, Peter. <laughs> for four, <laughs> questing beast, swing for four. Oh no. You can block him with the shot. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> He's got three power. And then I'm dead on Kirk. Right. Right. Good games, dude. Good games.